The New York Blood Center is calling on New Yorkers to donate blood tomorrow. The center wants to break the world record for blood donations as part of a worldwide drive on Global Blood Heroes Day. It's of particular importance right now because the city's blood supply currently stands at only a two to three day level, which is dangerous compared to the ideal level of five to seven days. To discuss the center's efforts is Andrea Seffarelli, Senior Vice President, Thanks for coming in this morning to talk more about this because, like I just said, it, it is so important. Thank you so much for having me. Yeah, the pandemic really uh, destroyed the foundation on which we collect blood. Pre-pandemic, 25% of our blood supply came from youth donors, and high schools and colleges are just not back. We also are seeing fewer first-time donors, and thousands of organizations in the city used to host blood drives, but with remote work, they just don't have the workforce to do it in the same way as a couple of years ago. Yeah, you don't see them the way that they used to, but let's right away tell New Yorkers where can they go to donate blood tomorrow for this? So all of our 18 donor centers are open and we have community blood drives. So you can visit nybc.org, put in your zip code, we'll show you the closest uh, donor center or community blood drive. And Global uh, uh, Blood Heroes Day, we're trying to, as you said, break the record. And in New York, we're trying to collect a thousand blood donations, which would be a huge Saturday for us. Do you think that you'll be able to do that? I'm hoping with uh, starting with you first thing this morning, <laughs> so we certainly hope so. Let's talk a little bit more about Glo Global Blood Heroes Day and the, and the worldwide aspect of it, because it's not just here in the city, of course. Yeah, so Who is Hussein is a not-for-profit that contacted us about a year ago, and they want to raise awareness on the need for first-time donors, diversity, and having blood donation become a lifetime commitment. And so this is just a perfect sort of one day in the middle of August when everyone is getting their last uh, vacation in to raise awareness that there's a constant need for blood. If you're not sure you have some kind of health condition and you're not sure if you're someone who should give blood, is there an easy way to figure that out? Yeah, so you can call our 800 number, 1-800-933-2566, or visit our website, nybc.org. Most people are eligible, uh, so go in and be surprised and save a life. And I was actually surprised to see someone is in need of blood every two seconds. Yeah, there's a constant need for blood. Patients with leukemia, sickle cell, accident vic victims, pregnant moms. Uh, so, yeah. I want to make sure that we give the information one more time. Where's the best place for people to go if they want more information before tomorrow? NYBC.org, and there is a zip code finder to find the closest and most convenient place to donate. That is perfect. I hope people get out there and give blood. Andrea, thanks so much for coming in and shining a light on this. Thank you so much. 8.36 right now. Steph, pint for pint. Yeah, such a good way to help, especially if you can do it, right? It's one of those things I feel like you do it once and you realize how easy, how harmless it can be, and you kind of go from there. So a good place to start tomorrow for sure. Uh,